Okay, as you can see, we got the benzaldehyde to boiling, and we recorded the temperature of our first drop of distillate at 84 degrees Celsius. You can see here in the receiver flask. One thing I forgot to mention is when you turn the aspirator on, make sure to turn the water on all the way to create maximum vacuum because otherwise the experiment will take way too long to get done. It's also a good idea when you turn on the heating well just to turn it on halfway and make sure the benzaldehyde doesn't boil over too quickly. If it starts really getting volatile, it can create what's called bumping. Not only can that wreck your experiment, it can also wreck the equipment. So if you see the benzaldehyde becoming really volatile, just turn down the temperature. You want to take a look inside where the menzaldehyde is boiling over, you can see it in the pot. You can see a little bit of steam coming on the top part of the flask there. That's what's called the holdup. That's the excess vapor. If you look into the distillation head, you can see the condensation forming in there and going back down into the pot. That's what's called the reflux. And now we're just waiting for the experiment to stabilize itself. We'll record our final temperature and be completed with the experiment. When you're done with the experiment, the first thing you want to do is turn off the heat and unplug the heating apparatus, allow everything to cool off first, and then start taking everything apart.